Hey everyone, it is Mom of Four Nicole, and I'm doing a quick empties video. I am cleaning, um, actually, all the boys are at Grandma's, so it's just me and the hubby. He has to go to work early, so, um, I'm just up late, um, cleaning. I'm having a problem with, like, these little black ants, um, like on the countertops and that's what I'm looking at I just saw one like on the baseboard do y'all know what I can use um to kill these ants I have tried vinegar and water in a spray bottle and now I'm actually using 20 drops of essential oil the peppermint and 20 drops of the tea tree and a spray bottle with water and Look, there goes my washing machine, and um, I just started it, but um, spraying it, so I don't know if it's working yet, but do you guys have any suggestions, because um, I just don't do bugs, and um, I need it safe for children, or at least the baby, so I saw some like little ant traps at Dollar Tree, but, um, you know, the baby could pick it up, things like that. So we live in an apartment and I guess I can put um, a request in for them to spray. But, um, you know, I don't know the chemicals they use either one. And I mean, we pay $5 a month for, uh, they charge us $5 a month for pest control and I never call them, but yeah, um, yeah, let me know. Comment below. So, I'm going to go through this video quickly um, just so I can throw this away because, uh, like I said, I'm up cleaning late at night and um, I wanted to clean this basket out. So, the first product is, and this is from um, the Dollar Tree, and this is the OxyClean Extra Strength Carpet Odor Eliminator. And as you guys can guess, I've already put this all over the carpet and um, vacuumed. I really, really like this product. I like that it has the OxyClean in it and um, you can't beat it for a dollar. Of course, you can buy it at you know Walmart or anywhere, but I bought this particular one at Dollar Tree. And y'all know what? I, I'm seeing um, a little ant and you know, I do have, you know, kids and I do get crumbs, but I vacuum every day. So it's not like I don't vacuum. I mean, of course, there's a crumb here or there with kids. But I wonder if I see there is a freaking ant. Can y'all see? Look at it. What the heck? I just put that stuff in vacuum. I wonder if maybe I put baking soda. Okay. Let's get back to the haul. We went through one of these. I got this particular one at Dollar Tree. Love it. You guys know I always haul that. Um, went through a Head & Shoulders 2-in-1 dry scalp with almond oil. Um, it says Dandruff Shampoo and Conditioner. I just used this. This was this one was mine. I just used this as a shampoo. Y'all know that this stuff ain't going to work for me as a conditioner. But it works great, and I highly recommend that. We went through a children's um, Advil. And, look, now I'm all looking for the ants. Actually, I finished this off because I gave some to the baby before he had his, you know, um, vaccination shots. His one-year-old ones. And I noticed it expired. So I didn't want to give it to the baby, and, um, you little, s I guess that ant I didn't kill, I just killed it, and, um, I didn't want to give it to the baby, and I didn't want to throw it away, I know it just wasn't, it with it being expired, it just wasn't as potent, but, um, yeah, I just took it when, um, my back was hurting. Um, I went through one of these fabric softeners, you guys know, Dollar Tree, these are awesome, but they're not making them anymore, the company, but, um, sad to go through one of those. I went through this, uh, face mask, I got a pack of these at, um, Burlington, these work really well, I 
I'm always afraid to try new uh, products that I haven't heard just for the simple fact in case it makes me break out or burns. I've had some face masks burn on me. Um, this one works really good. It had plenty of products, so it was nice and moist. So I definitely, definitely recommend this brand if you see it. They had a ton, all different ones. This just so happened to be the nighttime. Oh, I gotta go fast, y'all. We went through a Suave Everlasting Sunshine. Did not dig this scent. It's a bigger bottle of the Suave. Um, yeah, it just, the scent kind of got annoying after a while. And it was just too girlyish. I'm more of like coconut kind of smells. And we went through this Pantene Damage Detox uh, Conditioner. I actually used this conditioner with the head and shoulders. Um, of course, I switched between conditioners. But I kept going back to this one. It actually works great. So I highly recommend this. You guys know me. I know my conditioners because my hair is so thick. But yeah, this one um, is, is recommended. And it's got uh, mint oil in it. These from Skin Light Chin and Forehead Pore Cleansing Strips. I actually went through, I think, three of these. The hubby even used one. And uh, it works great. Um, I'm just now starting to try different brands. And that brand seems to be working for us. I went through a um, the Quinn Star World Casino. Just a hand lotion. I usually have hand lotions right next to the bed. And I usually am putting these little samples next to the bed. We went through another hand lotion. This is actually from Avon Bubble Bath Hand and Body Lotion. This was really, really thin. Um, it sm smells okay, but um, yeah, I'm not digging the Avon uh, lotions. And then good old trusty California Baby. You guys know I love the California Baby products. They're all natural, have essential oils. I actually use this on the baby. And then, um, I actually had this for a while, even when he was a uh, newborn. Um, like when I was breastfeeding and stuff. Um, I even put it, you know, in the areas that I needed to, especially if his face was against my chest and stuff. So, yeah, I use this. So this, uh, took us a while to go through. I'm going to take this sticker off and keep this bottle like I had the others. And then speaking of, here is another California Baby. This is a calming shampoo and body wash. And I think this has the pure essential oils where you focus head to toe. And, um, yeah, French lavender. Sensitive for adults, for babies and kids. This stuff is awesome. I love it. It kind of smells a little bit um, like lavender and tea tree oil. So if you're not into the essential oils... This probably isn't going to be for you. Well, I mean, it's I. I mean, you can use it on adults, but I use this on the baby. Um, but I liked it. It doesn't. This lasted for. Oh, it's wet. Um, this lasted forever. I mean, of course, it's a baby. The body, you know, isn't as big. Um, but you don't need a lot, so it it lathers nicely. And um, oh, it's why is it? Oh, it's just, but anyways, um, but yeah, I like it, and like for his, um, and I like the shampoo and body wash, but for his hair, the scent stayed on there, and it just stayed nice and clean, and, um, I, I'm all into putting a tea tree oil in the kids' shampoo, especially ones that go to school, because, um, mama over here don't want to have to deal with no lies, because you guys know how my hair is, so, um, I even put the, and the good thing about this is it already has the tea tree oil in it. We went through a St. Ives. I did get this at Dollar Tree. I uh, love it. The husband loves it as well. He uh, stole this from me and put it in the shower. Um, I will be purchasing a larger bottle of the St. Ives. I'm going to see if they have different scents though. And, um, you guys know I just got a bunch of these. We went through, like, five of them, but I only saved one. I just wanted to show you guys these, um, especially if you have kids. 
these taste great and these did not stick to I even ate some and there's um I was supposed to say there's two in a packet like y'all are gonna get these packets <laughs> but um um it says to eat two for children and um like I said uh, they don't stick to your teeth. They taste kind of like candy. It's not like too bad of a vitamin taste. You know, like the Flintstone gummies, they stick to your freaking teeth. And, uh, you know, I just took my kids to the dentist not too long ago, like a month ago. And the dentist said the worst thing that parents are doing is giving their kids the gummy vitamins. And what's happening is there's sugar in them. A lot of them, not all of them. So, parents, take a look at the ingredients on the back. I'm sure that there's sugar in these. Um, but like I said, they don't stick to your teeth. And that's what you you want in a vitamin, um, children's or adults. So, yeah, I, that's why I just saved those to show you guys that. This is like a random save of stuff, huh? And then you guys know I get these from the Dollar Tree. We did go through a whole package. I just hauled two more packages. These are wonderful, highly recommended. One of my favorite, favorite, favorite products from Dollar Tree. And I just discovered them. Went through a pumpkin marshmallow um, scent thingy. And this is from that brand right there. Um, oh, and it's vanilla wafer. It smells just like it says. Um, it just didn't last long. It, it was almost like, because I le we left the house, I put it in. It smelled real good. It was real strong for about an hour. And then we left and then came back a few hours later. And just to me, it just wasn't that strong. And I was hoping it would at least last a day or two, but yep. We went through a children's Advil. What happened was, is we ran out of ibuprofen. So, um, we were all kind of taking my stockpile. Because I have tons of these, especially from the doctor. Um, I found another freaking ant. What the freak? Um... And you guys know, I saw outside, there was like two ant piles in front of one window. I didn't check the other windows, but I bet you there's just ant piles all outside our apartment. This is not cool. Um, I forgot. Oh, yeah. So, we were all ended up taking this. So, bigger kids, the hubby, me. We went through a Eucerin Original Healing. This is actually, I use this by the bed. It's all right. Um, it doesn't have any scent. Um, so it's great just at night by the bed. And it's just an overall great lotion. I just have so many. So I'm not going to be purchasing a large bottle of this. Um, but I will if I ran out and I needed it. Um, boogie wipes. I have a ton of these samples. And... Um, I love these. If you guys haven't tried them, I actually use this one. So these are great for adults. So just because it says for kids, it's got the gentle saline um, in it. And it's 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 a wet, like a moist wipe, but not too moist. And um, it has a great scent as well. Um, so if you guys haven't already, even for adults, like I said, try these uh, boogie wipes. That's why I saved that. Like I said, it's just a sample, and I have a ton of samples. But went through the Bolero facial wipes. At first, I told you guys that it was disgusting. I hated the smell, but it did grow on me. I didn't want to waste it, so I did use it, and I ended up liking it. It wasn't as strong, the lavender, as um, I originally, um, you know, when I first bought it and smelled. So, yeah, I'm not going to be repurchasing these because you guys know I have a huge stock pile of these. And I want to just try more other than the Bolero brand. I got this in my Walmart Beauty Box. The Vaseline Intensive Care Advanced Repair. It was... Look, I'm all... A bug just flew in my face. But, um... It was great. I'm not going to be repurchasing a big bottle because it was, like, nothing special. Went through bath fizzers from Bolero. You guys know these work great. 
love them recommend them if you can find them pick you up one and then um Eucerin baby the baby had a, a diaper rash so I used this to wash his body and it was gentle and it was nice and um it was just a one-time use but um yeah I like it and I think I have a couple large bottles in the stockpile so that is it you guys that is my empties I am going to get off of this carpet and figure out what I'm gonna continue to spray that spray you know that I made but please 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 comment below and let me know what I need to do because I do not want my little man getting eaten up the ants that I found on the carpet are actually bigger ants y'all so I just found two making this video. Like I said, I just got done vacuuming and cleaning this carpet. So it's kind of freaking me out. Y'all comment below and let me know. But anyways, if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.